Welcome back to Just Don't Forget. Tonight's video for Morbid Pictures is also inspired by a creepypasta. This one is known as Till the End. Sometimes an idea can get stuck in your head. It can replay over and over and drive you a little crazy. Scary to think what some would do when driven a little crazy. Keep that in mind with tonight's video. Enjoy, and just don't forget. As I lay here, the end is coming. I can feel it. The Crimson River is starting to seep more slowly now. Either I'm running out or it's clotting. I don't want to shoot myself again. One should have been more in enough. Claire's already gone. She looks more peaceful now than she did a few moments ago. When I first confronted her about the idea of a murder-suicide pact, she didn't take it too seriously. But when I showed her my gun, she panicked. She knew I had business, but that I meant we should do it right now. I knew she'd never be able to kill me, so I let her go first. Shit, I'm sorry. Just, in general, just give me a second, okay? I'm sorry. Just took a few shots before she finally passed along. Then, I turned the gun on myself. I didn't want to shoot myself in the head. I knew from reading several medical textbooks that a suicidal headshot can have devastating consequences on the structure of the head. The whole area could be taken clean off. And people with no head can't have an open casket funeral. It could frighten people. I knew my mom would at least want to see me one last time. Heck, my weird cousin might even try to take a pic. I've known Claire for only six months. What a magical six months this was. Granted, we've only been dating for a few days. I knew it was love that we shared, and that we would continue to share in the afterlife. One of the good things about living in the middle of nowhere is that the nearest neighbor is at least a mile away. It'll be at least a few days before he knows we're gone and they start to investigate. I'd like to see the look in her faces. With the look of us, with a mixture of pity and disgust, as they see her bloated, rotting corpses on the ground and... scammers. Shit, I almost forgot about my dog. A beer with nothing to eat. He may even try to eat us well once I die. I know how to fix this. Okay, he's dead. I called him over as if I had something for him to eat. Oh, he ate it all right. Right in the head. I was so sorry for bringing an innocent into this, but no matter. He'll be our faithful canine companion in the afterlife. Wait, scapers can join us. Maybe I should kill a few more people. I'm sure our friends would like to join. Oh, I won't stop bleeding. Don't worry, Claire. I'll be with you soon. I just have to add a few more people to our afterlife. And then we could be together till the end of time. <laughs> <laughs> 